What did they say? Hope it isn't done too, too much. <laughs> it caught fire once. I think it's better if I cut it up out here. Unless you want to have a one yourself. We're going to have knives and forks after all. I've decided we're going to eat in style. Marriage must be wonderful with this sort of thing going on every day. I wonder if it's too cold out here. Maybe we should eat inside. Huh? Hasn't something like this happened before? What's the matter? Don't look so tense. Troubles? Well, Hanson, I think you better tell Mama what's going on, or all this secrecy is going to ruin my little dinner. Come on, Mr. D. What is darkening your brow? After dinner. No, now. Look, I'll make it easy for you. The time has come when you must tell me that you have a wife and two adorable children, and this madness between us can't go on any longer. I bet you've heard that line often enough. Right below the belt every time. Well, that isn't fair, Dad. Skip it. We have other things to talk about. We've got a job. Oh, so there is a job. You, uh, you remember a man named Sebastian? Alex Sebastian? Yes. One of my father's friends, yes. He had quite a crush on you. I wasn't very responsive. Well, he's here, the head of a large German business concern. His family always had money. He's part of the combine that built up the German war machine in hopes to keep on going. Something big? It has all the earmarks of being something big. We have to contact him. Go on, let's have all of it. We're meeting him tomorrow. The rest is up to you. You've got to work on him and land him. Marta Hari. She makes love for the papers. There are no papers. You land him. Find out what's going on inside this house, what the group around him is up to, and report to us. I suppose you knew about this pretty little job of mine all the time. No. I only just found out about it. Did you say anything? I mean, that maybe I wasn't the girl for such shenanigans. I figured that was up to you, if you'd care to back out. I suppose you told them Alicia Huberman will have this Sebastian eating out of her hand in a couple of weeks. She's good at that, always was. I didn't say anything. Not a word for that, that little lovesick lady you left an hour ago. I told you, that's the assignment. Well, now, don't get sore, dear. I'm only fishing for a little bird call from my dream man. One little remark such as, how dare you gentlemen suggest that Alicia Huberman, the new Miss Huberman, be submitted to so ugly a fate. That's not funny. Do you want me to take the job? You're answering for yourself. I am asking you. It's up to you. Not a peep. Oh, darling, what you didn't tell them, tell me. That you believe I'm nice and that I love you and I'll never change back. I'm waiting for your answer. What a little pal you are. Never believing me, hmm? Not a word of faith, just down the drain with Alicia. That's where she belongs. Oh, Dev. Dev. When do I go to work for Uncle Sam? Tomorrow morning.
Oh, we shouldn't have had this out here. It's all cold now. What are you looking for? I had a bottle of champagne. I must have left it somewhere. 